The most interesting thing in tech, so people don't really trust any of the benchmarks anymore because they've all been hacked. So I have one very specific benchmark that I like to follow, which is my nephew Emmett. And so every Christmas, or at least this is now the second time we've done it, but we'll do it for the next 50, I ask Emmett what his favorite AI model is. Last year he talked about Claude. I have not prepared him. I don't know what he's gonna say, so let's go. Emmett, what is your favorite AI model? Uh, my favorite AI model right now is Gemini. Oh wow, why? Because it doesn't forget things, and ChatGPT and Claude forgets things, especially during long coding tasks. And when did you notice this change in Gemini? Uh, Gemini, a little while ago, I think it was like beginning of the fall, started to get much better at not forgetting things. Could start doing long coding tasks, long context windows, and it would stick to the same brief that it had given me. And you had previously given your top ranking to Claude because you liked its personality. Do you still stand by that? I do think Claude has a very nice personality, but I mean, say in ChatGPT, you can almost replicate that personality, and Gemini has made a lot of improvements in its personality too. So it's not really that much of a selling point. Llama, DeepSeek, any of the other models that you use and like? Uh, I, I like Llama and DeepSeek for the idea that they were open source that anybody could run them. But for DeepSeek, what I didn't like was, of course, the censorship that you ask it about Tiananmen Square. No, no, no. Uh, Llama is just not as good. And do you use the deep research mode in the different AI models? Oh, yes, I love it. I love just being able, for example, uh, I was very intent on figuring out a specific kind of manipulation of an audio wave. And I asked all three models and just Gemini blew it out of the water. And are there any concerns you have with Gemini? Uh, I would say Google, of course, sells all your data and not very good in privacy, in my opinion. So that could be a concern, but basically all of the AI corporations are doing it uh, with Anthropic to a less so extent, but that's basically digital life. So that would be my primary concern. All right, that's the most interesting thing in tech, the Emmett Benchmark. We'll do it again in a year.